at least all the time? No, not really. I wish. Go? Okay. I wish every time I walked into a room that happened. Very excited. <laughs> I will look into making that happen for you. Um, we were just talking about snacks. I've heard that you keep a fortune cookie. Is is this true? Like a, a fortune, like in your phone? At yeah. All times? I, I mean. I, I sort of have lost the meaning a little bit. Like a long time ago, I was like, oh, I, felt, I got a fortune, and I was like, oh, I hope this one comes true. So I, held I on had to like it. a clear, yes, yeah. I had a clear phone case, and I was yeah. like, well, I'll just put it in the clear phone case, and then I got another one, and I was like, oh, I'll put that one in there too. And then something happened where I lost them, but I just kind of kept putting new ones in. But then recently, um, on an airplane, a man used it as a way to ha start a conversation with me. So oh. I feel like I have to stop doing that because yeah. I don't need that much attention. on an airplane in general, no. you just want to put your headphones yes. on immediately and just, yeah. Because mm -hmm. a lot of us, it's not that we're trying to be rude. It's just no. that I have kids, y'all. I'm mm -hmm. never alone. Yeah. I don't want to talk to you, yeah. not because I'm trying to be mean. I just don't want to talk. Like, yep. it's just like, you just want your, you're like, oh my God, this is the, this is the time. This yes. is my me time. Yeah. yeah. I get you. Maybe stop carrying things that That's start conversations. Yes. yes. Well, I know. I'm, gonna, <laughs> I'm taking it out. It was okay. removed. <laughs> well, I actually, I love fortune cookies. M me and my eight-year-old daughter love them. We're obsessed with them. So um, do you want to open some new fortune cookies yeah. together? Yeah. See what we get? Yes. Okay. Do you, do, the, do, you do the rule where you have to eat it first? And oh my God, I thought fortune? you were going to say the rule that's not a children appropriate, but no. Oh no, no. I don't know that one. <laughs> no, all. you know, like you put in the bedroom at the end of every, Oh. you know. No, I don't know What? That. No, I don't know. Like you read it and then it's like in the bedroom. Oh, it's like, yes. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. That one. Okay. okay, we're opening. Well, my rule is okay. you have to eat a little bit of the cookie before you read it. Oh, okay, okay. But otherwise it won't come true. What if you don't like the fortune? Well, that's just too bad. Okay. And um, mine says, "Oh, oh, mine's what? pretty good. Mine is too. You will be the next in line for a promotion." <gasps> Congratulations! Yeah, I'm really excited. Congratulations. Hey, What's yours? Mine is um, the only way to have a friend is to be one. Oh, that is nice. I love that. Be what you want. Yeah. I might keep that in my phone. I'm actually going to keep this one in my phone. Like, don't talk to us about it. Yeah, exactly. I don't <laughs> care who talks to me about this one. I would like a promotion. <laughs> so, your new show, Yellow Jackets, is in season two. So if people didn't catch season one, uh, explain a bit. Yes. Um, the premise of the show is that in 1996, um, a girls' soccer team goes off to nationals and their chartered flight crashes and they're stranded in the wilderness um, and all kinds of trauma kind of occurs afterwards. You know, there's, there's, there, there's um, like a supernatural element to it, but you're not sure if that's just them freaking out and seeing things or whether this or if is it's really real. happening. Yeah. And then it sort of cuts um, in between 1996 and them stranded in the woods. Young. Yeah, like they're younger 16. kids. Yeah, yeah. Around 6, 15, 16, and then to the older survivors. Yeah. So, um, and that's present day. So I'm one of the older survivors. Congratulations yeah, again. Yeah, I survived. Um, so <laughs> you've been acting just since you were super young. Mm -hmm. how, how young were you when you started? I started when I was seven. Jeez, like yeah. my daughter's eight. Yeah, my, do my son is eight, and I always use it against him. He'll say, like, he can't, he's like, he, he'll tell me he can't do something, and I'll be like, well, I was working 12-hour days You're that mom. outside in the cold when I was, I was a year younger than you. So guess what? I know you can do it. Oh, my God, I love you're that parent that's like, I walk to school yes, uphill really, both ways. I really am. I am. <laughs> I love that. So wait, how, do you, how do you feel looking back on that? Was it hard when you were a kid or fun, and you just kind of were in it? When I was a kid, it was so fun. I loved it. I, um, I really enjoyed escaping from sort of my, my home life and I didn't like going to school and I didn't like being a kid and getting to go to set and, and be good at something and to be encouraged and yeah, and to, to be successful at something. And um, I liked the actual day-to-day -day work and everything. And it wasn't until I was older and a teenager that, uh, that I really kind of felt the effects of fame. And it was the fame aspect that I didn't like. I loved yeah. the work itself, but I didn't really enjoy all the this specific attention of fame. And that can be hard. Yeah, and I think yeah. it's really hard too when you don't even know who you are yet to be have to As ask questions teenagers. about who you are. Yeah. Like how are you supposed to present yourself to the world when you don't know who you are? And you're learning so, that. 
Yeah. I'm so glad I wasn't around when social media was oh my huge God, me too. when I was young. I was like a feral creature as a teenager, I... so it would have been a real bad situation for me. Like, all of us were odd. Like, right? Or just figuring it out and making mistakes. <laughs> yeah. Like, not in, the, in front of the world. No, I don't yeah. know how everybody... I, I know, so my well. kids hate me. I'm like, no phone. <laughs> Sorry. No, I know. It's a yeah. big thing with Freddie as well. My son, he's yeah. so mad he can't have his, his phone. My daughter's friends have phones, and I'm like, that's yes. so great for them. Congratulations. That's, that's what Freddie says, too. <laughs> yeah. Freddie's like, whoever, someone has a phone and I'm, I'm always like, well, I, yeah, well, you, you can't have one. I'm, I, so I'm like, who do you need to call? Well, that's the who other thing. Who are you calling? That's the other thing, too. I'm like, but you have an iPad. That's what I said. And you don't make phone calls on it, and you could. They hate being on the iPad. They hate talking. I'm like, what are you, it's not. So why do you need a phone? This is, yes. And I don't like, know. why are people giving their eight year olds phone? I'm not judging I mean, I'm just questioning. And then, I, and then he, he was talking about someone having a phone, and I was like, well, if you were walking home from school, yes, I might give you a phone. That's for what emergencies. I said. And he's like, well, I'll walk home from school then. And I was like, <laughs> you're not allowed to walk home from school. <laughs> it's like, we, <laughs> yeah, this is my daughter. Um, so your husband does something nice for you with memorabilia, like from yeah. the past. What, what is it? Can you explain? I had never saved anything from my career, anything. Like, I don't have my magazine covers from when I, I was either. younger. I, don't, I yeah. didn't save any of it. Mm -hmm. um, and he thinks that that's, that's he, he wants, he like, is encouraging me to be very proud of my career and everything. So he's yeah. gone back and bought, found them all on eBay and bought them for me and was like, Saving, the, I know, he's very, It's kind very of sweet. an amazing scrapbook, too. I always think now there's a mom, like, for your kids. Yeah. That's the only reason why I keep anything now, because I'm like, they might not care, but they might. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. When I was little, I really cared about my mom's. Uh, my mom had, my mom was a model, and so she had her book with all her tear sheets, and I really did care about that, so yeah. I get... I get his point. Yeah. Yes, about like the kids wanting it, and and yeah. I, it also like is not it's nice, and I think now that it's most of his magazine covers are like twenty years old, and now that I'm twenty years from that person, it's like removed. I'm from able it. Yeah. to like be like, oh yeah, that was great, you know. Yeah. <laughs> And you look, I always look at things and people show me and I'm just like, oh my God, I was like a baby. Yeah, <laughs> like exactly. 19, it feels like, like a what? different person. It really yeah. does. I love age.